Hey there, welcome to my lens hack. To do this lens hack, you're going to need a 2 times teleconverter. And uh, as far as I know, this can only be done with a 70 to 300 lens. Uh, the reason being is that uh, the distance at where the uh, rear lens element is, is recessed. It's recessed far enough so when you attach the teleconverter into it, it's not going to scrape up against the lens and damage anything and that's that was my major concern would this actually fit together if you can get them to connect together and from what I could tell uh, just by looking at the uh, 70 to 200 lens uh, the distances were were pretty much bang on there was room for them to go uh, back and forth no problem not going to touch anything damage anything um, so, uh, first off, what I had to do was uh, just take a look at how the two lenses, you know, what was the difference. Uh, the difference that, from what I could see was uh, on the back of the mount, um, there's a, a little cutaway, and that little cutaway fits just perfectly into the 2 times teleconverter. Whereas on the 70 to 300, uh, there is no cutaway. It just goes straight across. There's a, like a little mounting ridge on there, and it goes straight across, blocking it from attaching to the teleconverter. Uh, so what I had to do was I took out uh, a Dremel and just compared uh, where the cutaway is on the 70 to 200, and uh, and just cut out a small little section. It was just uh, the the section I had to cut away was like. It was so minor, it was just a tiny little spot um, on, on the mount and it took all of like less than five seconds to cut away that little piece of, of mount to uh, fit it into the teleconverter. So before, uh, before it just, it wouldn't connect and now uh, with that little cutaway it just, it fits in there perfectly and snaps together like like perfect um, I've done that already and uh, and now I'm about to do a field test and uh, let's go check it out see how it turns out okay so here we are with the field test uh, I'm using a D300S and uh, you know, why not? It's a DX body, DX lens. Try it out and see what we're getting here. My settings are ISO 400, uh, exposure time 1250, and F5.6. Fully extended, it's not losing any stops, and it says 5.6. I don't know what that means. I have no idea, but uh, I'm going to take some shots anyway to try it out. Wow, this is pretty crazy. Uh, it seems to be working okay. And uh, I'll try shooting some video. Wow, you get some like crazy, crazy range now. Wow. Uh, actually, I kind of like it. It gives it kind of a neat, uh, I don't know, just uh, really throws everything out of focus in the background. If you're shooting up close and you're fully extended. That's crazy. Uh, wow, that's awesome. Uh, I don't know. I'm shooting uh, this with manual mode too. I tried with the... Um, in autofocus, and it seemed to be the lens. I could hear the, you know, it jumping around and and going crazy. So I, I turned it off, and uh, I also turned the VR off. So I don't know. Uh, I'll post the pictures into the video, and you guys can you guys can be the judge. Hope you enjoy the hack.